Capricorn, what's up? It's your girl Cat. We're going to do your weekly reading right now. Uh, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Eight of Cups. So that's walking away from something that's no longer making you happy or serving you or fulfilling you. All right, let's lay these down and see what we got, okay? All right. Right off the, my first impression is a lot of pentacles. So it could have to do with money. Could be a financial reading for you today, Capricorn. Uh, could also have to do with security and stability. So we'll clarify in just a second. But looks like you're, you, yeah, I think this is like a work focus. It looks like you're working towards something. Um, and you're gonna get an offer. All right, looks like working towards something, okay? Putting or getting recognized at work. This is sticking up for yourself, setting boundaries, um, taking a stand. So I feel like you made a decision to be more like assertive and stick up for yourself a little bit more and it got you recognized at work. And then bam, here we go. Here's an offer of security and stability. This could also be some type of a second chance. So... If you were passed up for a position or a promotion or a raise, something like that previously, this could be a second chance at this. Hmm. Could be feeling like you're not getting the fair share that you deserve at work and it's got you kind of like feeling emotionally like the weight of the world on your shoulders, okay? I feel like you've been waiting for a raise or a promotion for a while. Okay, and then you're going to get some kind of a communication about this. Oh, that was in the daily reading today. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, about your money, security, stability. Walking away from what doesn't serve you. The fool. It's a new path, a new journey. Okay. So I think that you were in a position that you felt very like you weren't recognized. You didn't feel like it was like, you know, you weren't treated equally there. Um, it wasn't a good feeling for you. It wasn't a good fit for you. And you've been wanting this promotion or this raise, raise or this job change for a while. Because um, I think it's going to make you feel more secure and it's better money. Um, yeah. And it looks like you're turning your back on what isn't working for you here and starting a new path and a new journey, okay? But there's a decision to be made. The Queen of Wands, okay? Something to do with um, somebody who is very like magnetic and chariz charismatic, very, uh, they have a lot of magnetic appeal, a lot of sex appeal. A decision, oh, maybe you have to leave this person in order to get this, pro oh. <laughs> yeah and that's unspoken thoughts and feelings so you're keeping your feelings about this to yourself and there's an offer of um, no this is a message about um, commitment stability or finances hmm. so maybe you haven't told this person yet about this, I feel like it's a job promotion that's going to, or a job offer that's gonna take you somewhere else. I feel like you have to relocate to get it. And you haven't told this this magnetic, wonderful person about this yet. <laughs> yeah, keeping it to yourself for just now, being strong, because now is not the, the right time to bring it up, right? It's all about timing. Why is regret and disappointment here? Oh, okay. So I think that you're afraid that once you tell whoever this person is that you got this great job offer, this promotion, whatever, but it's in another state or another city or something. And now you're going to be like long distance. I think that you're afraid they're going to be disappointed and no longer want to be in the relationship with you or be interested. Okay. But, I mean, it looks like a great opportunity for you. I'm going to shuffle these. And I'm going to pull a couple more. Because I want to see what the outcome of this is. What is the outcome of this reading for Capricorn? Hmm. Hmm. 
the Queen of Cups, the Eight of Swords, the Three of Wands, and the Six of Swords. All right. So I feel like this person is very loving, very giving, very nurturing, or that could be you. You have a lot of love for somebody here, probably for this person. You feel stuck. Unfortunately, I think your love for this person is making you feel stuck. And I think that you are making plans to accept this offer and relocate somewhere. But here's the Six of Swords, which is moving out of hard times and into karma waters. But Mira, how many people? <laughs> so I think this person's gonna be on board with you. So don't worry too much about this. And you're gonna do what's best for you. You know, this is a fantastic opportunity. To get three pentacles in a row like that, you get the Three of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles all in a row. I mean, which says to me that's opportunity and, and wealth and financial stability lining up for you. Um, for some of you, it could be a commitment, but I'm feeling that that is it's a solid job offer somewhere else. <laughs> All right, let's see. What do we want to pull? Let's pull these. I've been using these constantly lately. I love these. I don't know if it's going to fit with this reading, but we'll see. if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet would love if you do that for me <laughs> doesn't cost you anything it helps grow my channel or tell a friend too all right ready <laughs> not today boundaries and hurt avoiding conversation not dealing still upset So I think that when you do talk to this person, they're not going to be happy at first. And I do think that you're avoiding having this conversation with them. Date. Get back out there, meeting someone new, setting a date, date online. So... You know, I said moving out of hard times and into karma. What are the two people here? I don't know, maybe you're gonna meet somebody new. <laughs> um, let's pull one more. Not enough. Lacking confidence, self sabotage, ego and fear, frustrations. Okay. So I think that that whoever this person is. I think that they're not they're not actually going to be on board with this. Um, but that's not the important thing here. Let's pull, let's pull a power of love for you. The important thing is that you have a really great opportunity coming towards you and you'll meet somebody new. All right, let's see. I'm going to put my glasses on. Joy. You delight in the love of life and bring a spirit of fun to all that you do. Okay. So don't worry about it. It's all going to be great in wherever you go, wherever you relocate to, wherever, you know, your path takes you. You're going to find the joy in your daily life, no matter what. Okay, Capricorn, because you're just that kind of person. All right. You have great energy and it'll all be fine. All right, so that's what I have for you today. I hope that you liked that. Happy 4th of July. And until next time, take care. Bye.